Prince Harry filing lawsuits against two tabloids over alleged phone hacking, accusing The Sun and Daily Mirror of intercepting his voicemail. This within days of his wife Meghan Markle announcing a lawsuit against the Mail on Sunday over a breach of privacy for publishing Merkel's private letter to her dad. Here with more is Robert Bianchi, former prosecutor and criminal defense attorney. Welcome again, Robert. Hi, Good to have you here. Good to be here. So what do you make of these lawsuits and could they be successful? They could be successful. Um, it, it, it depends on the facts, and we really don't know all the facts right now. But I would think as a lawyer, if the prince were coming to me, the question for him as a high-profile figure, many of which I represent now in my criminal defense practice, is do you want to mix it up and get into the swamp and the mud with uh, what's going to occur here in a lawsuit? Because all your dirty laundry is going to be turned upside down, and that's going to be a feeding frenzy for the media, the very thing that he's trying to prevent from happening. And his whole life and all of his blemishes and boo-boos and everything that happened could be exposed. I think it's going to be a media frenzy. This is a very sensitive issue likely for Prince Harry, though, given what happened to his mother uh, related to the tabloid. So do you think that that is, is sort of uh, compelling his decision? Yeah, he actually said that. He said that he didn't want his wife to be victimized. Hey, I feel bad for the guy. I mean, it's very difficult. I was in a high-profile public figure when I was the head prosecutor. I can only imagine what he's dealing with, people saying things that are untrue. Mm -hmm. You know they're untrue. And this is your wife. And he he said he didn't want his wife to be subjected to what happened to his mother. So I think that is first and foremost in his mind. We have a statement from News Group Newspapers, who owns The Sun and The Daily Mail, saying, we confirm that a claim has been issued by the Duke of Sussex. We have no further comment to make at the current time. Um, and then we have a statement from The Mirror to Fox & Friends, no comment to share on this at this stage. Are you surprised that they're not saying anything? Uh, no, I'm not surprised. First of all, you shouldn't be saying anything in the context of litigation. And moreover, a lot of this information, what exactly is being alleged here is not out into the public right now but the best advice always is and I advise my clients and I deal with it myself personally is the more you speak the more fuel and oxygen you put on the fire and it's like a beast the media no disrespect we're both in the yeah. media world but it's like a, a, a character in Dante it reminded me of the hungrier it is the more it eats and the more it eats the hungrier it becomes so to me less is more when you're yeah. dealing with this that's good advice but sometimes it's so hard to follow because sure. If you see things about yourself that are untrue, or if you see things about people you love that are untrue, you want not only to set that record straight, but you want to hold the people accountable who are running like wildfire with these, you know, potentially hacking into your voicemail. I mean, that's some serious stuff. Yeah, and that to me should be left for prosecutors to deal with if there is that kind of hacking, because that would, in my mind, be a crime over there in England. But you bring up a great point, Jed. In my mind, the media strategy should be there. I don't know if you do it through the vehicle of a lawsuit as opposed to a public relations campaign. At at least that's how I handle it with my clients. A lawsuit is a bad place because you now are on the crucible of being cross-examined by lawyers for the other side, and that can get ugly. It seems to me as a very high-level public figure as he is, or even a public figure that's you know not quite as high, it's, it's very difficult and challenging to win a lawsuit like this. You make a statement by filing one, but do, can, can you actually win this? Uh, you, well, yeah, you can. In and, fact, and how? And because many it, people in England have won them. because they've won a lot of money from them. These, these millions and millions of dollars from these tabloids who have done some very bad things. So if uh, it, it has been successful in the past, mm. and it could be for him, but not without a lot of damage. And again, the more he's out there, the more media frenzy there is. Well, I can say I understand his rage, though. I really do. Absolutely. And I think many of us can. Thanks for being here. You and got it, in, Jen. As always. Okay.